first, let's write our name and class on our paper and then flip it over. Start by drawing an oval on its side in the middle of your paper. This is the opening of our mug. Now on the ends of the oval, let's draw two vertical, that means up and down lines, the same length. Next, we're going to connect those vertical lines with a curve or a smile line. This will make our mug look round. Then let's draw a letter C attached to the side of the mug. Make it nice and big because you're going to draw a small letter C inside of it. Now we can't leave our mug floating in midair, so let's draw a table for the mug to sit on. This is just a horizontal line, that just means straight across, that goes behind your mug. Good job. If you want to draw some marshmallows in your mug, I personally love marshmallows in my hot cocoa, then you can draw some rounded squares and rectangles that overlap. Overlap means that they cover each other up just a little bit. That makes your mug look like it's full of marshmallows. You can also draw some wavy and swirly lines coming up from your mug to look like steam. Now I'm going to trace all of my pencil lines with a black marker. You can use whatever coloring materials you're going to use to make your patterns. Alright, we have our outline. Now let's fill this baby in with some patterns. Remember, a pattern is something that repeats in the same order. Feel free to get really creative with your patterns. Just make sure you fill the whole page.